I really love Letary. Um, I, I have him on one of my fantasy leagues. Unfortunately, though, and this is kind of a fantasy hockey rant, but it's also a rant that ties into the, the team in general. So just give All me right. a second here. But um, I have Letary as a depth guy on one of my fantasy teams. 32-team league. Um, oh, that explains like, it. I was like, damn, you're yeah. going down to Letary? What the hell? Yeah, yeah. Uh, we get, uh, I think, 20 spots, I, I believe. Okay. Yeah, so 15 you're, guys play, and then you have five like, on the You're playing like a whole roster, pretty much. Pretty much, yeah. It, it's very close to that. So that's why we're going into guys like Letary. Um, and, and I have him as a depth guy, because when he plays, he scores, and he gets you points. Mm. The unfortunate thing is, whenever I put him into my roster, because I'm like, oh man, he's killing it right now. Like, he's gonna, we're playing, <laughs> Ducks are playing four games, awesome, let's throw him in. He doesn't play a single fucking game all week, <laughs> even though he scored two goals the game before, had a goal and an assist the game before that, and then it's like, ah, oh, well, we got this guy back, and yeah, you've been killing it for us, but taxi squad. And Ladies it, and gentlemen, Dallas Eakins. <laughs> exactly, yeah, and then when it, you know, guys are injured, and then I, like, set my roster for the week, and I'm like, well, Letary hasn't played in four games, so obviously I'm not going to put him in. Yeah. And then Tuesday rolls around. Letary enters the lineup. Have fucking, you know, two goals and an assist, five hits and four blocks. I'm like, <laughs> like are you fucking kidding me? So I've just resorted to keeping him on my bench because I can't justify dropping him. But whenever he's on my bench, he does really well in the games for us. So yeah. I'm, I'm taking one for the team. <laughs> but I'm just miffed about it because not only for my fantasy team, this team is just better with Letary on it. He gets, he's like Mason McTavish, but older, honestly. He yeah, gets into, I don't hate that either. Yeah, he gets in front of the net and he just like gets to those dirty areas, goes for tips, bat, like bangs in rebounds. He fills in on the power play because he only gets called up when guys in our top six are injured and they're just like, fuck it, you can go. Then yeah. we don't have to, you know, mess up our whole line chemistry. And we, God forbid we put fucking Derek Grant on the power play, but that's another conversation <laughs> um, for another time, not tonight. Um, but they put Letary on there and he's just like taking one timers and, you know, either getting goals or assists on the power play. And he, he's killing it. And obviously it's probably not sustainable. It's like, well, I get, I'm getting to get called up for a couple games. So I'll just show these guys on the bench what I can do and then they're like sick we appreciate what you do AHL for you see you, <laughs> see you, see see you later. next week like, <laughs> yeah, exactly <laughs> but I, I would just love to see Letary in a, a more permanent role on this team both for my fantasy team and also for the Ducks <laughs>